Did you know that one in 200 people will need a bone marrow transplant at some point in their life? And did you know that your baby's umbilical cord may be another option? Umbilical cord blood has stem cells in them that are used to treat over 80 diseases and disorders. How does cord blood help someone with leukemia, lymphoma, or a blood disorder like sickle cell disease? It can save a life. You can relieve someone of sickle cell disease or certain cancers. A person who receives a cord blood transplant have a high chance of being cured from that disease. It's important to me as an African American and as a mother, if it ever became a point where me or my daughter needed a transplant, I would want that as an option. Sickle cell disease is a genetic blood disorder that may lead to pain, infection, stroke, and even death. This disease is highest in Black and African American communities and the only cure is a cord blood or bone marrow transplant. And so it's really important that we get um, African Americans to donate um, because this is a, a life-saving treatment. Why are cord blood donations from Black and African Americans so important? 70% of patients will not find a match within their family. So that 70% would have to search outside resources you're more likely to find a match of someone who's the same ethnic and racial background, essentially someone who looks like you. We want people to understand uh, the value of core blood donation and why we encourage people to donate their baby's core blood. The core blood is collected once you are at the um, labor and delivery. Once the baby is delivered, the cord is clamped, and then the cord blood is collected into a sterile bag similar to when you donate blood. It's a really simple and easy process. It does not interfere with your bonding with your baby. It doesn't interfere with your um, delivery experience um, whatsoever. The collection process is easy and painless, and your information remains confidential. Your family probably won't even notice that the donation is happening. In order to sign up for core blood donation, you can speak with your prenatal provider. You can also go to Bloodworks Northwest's website. There are two forms that you would fill out prior to your delivery, and you would have those ready when you go to the hospital to deliver your baby. You have this opportunity in an easy and simple way to take that cord blood and donate it to a public cord bank where it can be used to save someone's life. The next generation brings hope in many ways. Learn more at bloodworksnw.org slash cord blood. I would absolutely donate my cord blood to help save someone's life.